Hi, if you ever needed to set up a video conference to meet with colleagues, you can do so through the Google Calendar. That's probably the easiest way to do this. So I'm going to go into my Google and I'm going to go to the calendar. And let's say I want to set up a new appointment for next Tuesday. I'm going to add an appointment and I'm going to say conference meeting and I can let's say I'm going to make it from 11 to 11:45 I'm going to invite NCHS library and I'm going to add a location or conferencing so I'm going to add a conference and now I've created a little specialized appointment there and I'm going to save it and it's going to say do I want to send an invite to my guests and I'm going to say yes I want to send an invite to my guest okay good now I'm going to go to that other profile to show what it looks like on their end so I'm going to go to NCHS library oh look I have an invitation to a meeting I'm going to open that and I can accept it here I also have in my email invite this little link to go to the conference meeting. I can join with a headset on my computer or just using the mic on my computer or I can join by phone if for some reason my audio isn't working on my computer so that's an option to keep in mind. So I'm going to say yes I'm going to go to this meeting so I'll say yes and I'm also going to go view it on the calendar so I want you guys to see what it looks like. On Tuesday the 10th here's my conference and I can join the Hangouts Meet or I can join by phone. So if I click on this, I have to allow it and the camera's starting and I can join the meeting. And ta-da! Now if I go back to the other one, the other side of this conference meeting, I'm going to join the Hangouts and I'm going to join the meeting. And of course, it's going to make terrible noises. So the reason it did that is because I'm in the same room on the same computer and it's making creating an echo. Um, that won't happen in your situation unless you're sitting in the same room with the people you're conferring with. Um, but it is a good example of why it is best to use headphones and with a mic built in and just a regular old earbuds that can plug into your computer are perfect for that. Um, I do find that it um, preserves the best, it creates the best sound quality experience you can have um, because otherwise you can run into echo problems. Another option or something you can keep in mind is when you're not talking during a conference is you can actually mute your microphone and then turn it back on when you're speaking. So that's helpful. Also, if you're not comfortable being on camera, you don't have to be. And then this, of course, is the hang up tool. So once you hit that, you're out of the meeting. But the good news about that is if you accidentally do that, you can just go ahead and rejoin. Right? And then you're back in. So hopefully that helps uh, give you some ideas about how to use video conferencing if you needed to meet with another colleague.